Good evening, my name's Penny. This evening I'm going to pull a card from my card deck. It's called The Whole Woman and it includes many aspects of what a fully rounded or a whole woman looks like in action. I'm going to shuffle my card deck first. I'm going to select one for tonight. Okay, the whole woman is magnetic. I am the heroine of my journey. Now, I love this. I am the heroine of my journey. So, again, we're talking about being magnetic, being a woman, a person who magnetizes effortlessly experiences and people and opportunities to herself. So a magnetic woman is a heroine of her own life. She's the leading lady in her life. And she sees her journey as a hero's journey, a heroine's journey, uh, something that is not taken lightly. It's not something that you drift along and, and live your life vicariously or uh, without passion and purpose. Your life is the journey of the heroine, the journey of someone who is continually expanding and growing and learning and someone who becomes more and more uh, throughout his or her life. So it's not just living, existing, surviving, but the heroine's journey is one of continually becoming more integrated, more alive, more capable, confident and competent, and all the good things that we can be that allow us to then experience life on a whole new level and lots of different new levels. So it involves discipline, it involves courage, it involves dark nights of the soul, difficult times, everything that might happen in our lives that we have no choice but to navigate in the best and most courageous and most centered way that we can. So life is unexpected. It isn't a straight path that we can predict, that we can know. Life takes us around many turns and often it's only when we look back that we would wonder, you know, what happened? That was an incredible <laughs> experience I had. I can't believe that I went through that or that I survived that or that I actually grew and expanded through that experience and we can look back with great appreciation at what we have achieved and survived and the way that we've become more of ourselves through life's difficult times and also through those beautiful times those expansive times they don't have to be difficult but in this density in this third <laughs> density reality uh, sometimes we do have to grow through that pain. Hopefully in the future that won't be our experience and we'll be able to grow through experience of joy and life and there are many ways to grow. But the heroine's journey is to take those good times and those challenging times and just ride those waves that as they come the highs and the lows and everything in between. So life isn't always <laughs> easy, but it's the way that we embrace it and the way that we trust ourselves, trust God and the higher power and source that we will have the courage, that we'll have the resilience and the resourcefulness to more than survive, but thrive in those times and yes looking back there's been many of those difficult times for me 
hopefully the future it will be a little bit more smooth sailing. I think it's when we're young that we don't always have those resources uh, at hand. So they're within us, but we don't always know how to access them. And that's something we learn through experience. So we realize that we are more than we thought, that we're more capable than we thought, that we're more resilient than we imagined. And we developed this great tool kit of tools and um, skills that we can use in many situations in life. So often as we become older, things just don't knock us down to the level that they used to because we have those tools and we know that we have what, what it takes to keep going. So I am the heroine of my journey. The whole woman is magnetic. <laughs>